Hey guys, this is Dennis, the founder of Think Hero. And I'm David Griffin, your resident comic book and video game guru. And this is our review of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. episode, what is this, 14? 14, yep. Track after along, Tahiti. Tahiti, after a long break. Mm-hmm, very long. After what <laughs> I, I would say is the best episode of, of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. so far. I'm not going to say it was a great episode, but it was the best one that the Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. has had so far. Sure. And of course, what do they do? They take a big long break. It's been like, th is it three almost weeks? A month, you know, almost a month. Almost a month. Almost a month, yeah. And so th this episode continues on from that one where we, you know, see Sky get mm -hmm. shot and they're trying to save her. Um, I think this episode wasn't as good as the last one, but in terms of where it falls in Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., it's one of the better episodes because yeah. it actually follows a story instead of episodic. Right. I mean, that's one thing you know I've been harping on. I'm glad that they have a story going now. Uh, I wish I cared more about Sky's <laughs> fate. I still don't, but at least they are telling the big story. I, I, I love seeing, you know, Bill Paxton, who's mm -hmm. one of my favorite actors, you know, from back in the day with Aliens, you know, he's the man. So it's great seeing him on here. Um, you know, there were some good action sequences mm -hmm. here when they stormed the base. There were some good moments in this episode. You know, again, it's always weird talking about Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. because they're always like, it's a good Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. episode. We never say it's a good, I never heard any of us say it's a good episode of television. Mm. I don't think we've gone quite that far yet, but it's a good Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. episode for what they've been doing so far. It, and it's better than what they've done in the past. Definitely, it's, definitely better. Definitely better. I still can't. Definitely better. I wouldn't recommend the show to anyone yet. No, mm -hmm. I'd have to see more. They'd right. have to develop more you know, of the characters and the plots, and then maybe I can be like, oh, you know what, it gets good and This is supposed to be a new arc, on. like it's even a new title, it's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Uprising, I yeah. believe. Yeah, so this is like a whole new arc, I think Bill Paxton signed on, I think he's on for at least four episodes. So. I liked him, I yeah. thought he, he brought some, a different type of character. A little weight to the show Yeah, that needed, personality, you know, right. you know, cause you know, with Sky and Agent War, they, they seem kind of, I don't know, kind yeah. of blank. Even, and I love, uh, even Agent Coulson at times gets a little repetitive mm -hmm. in his mannerisms and Clark Gregg's a good actor. I know he's capable of doing a lot of good work, but it seems like even his thing, he just gets kind of repetitive. He's just doing the same thing every week. Yeah, so mm -hmm. I, I liked it for what it was. Mm -hmm. I, I hope they continue on with it. Um, what do you think of uh, the, the ending with... Uh... All right, so here's my thing with this the whole... Uh, Butcher her name like Lorelai or Lorelai. Yeah. Like she is a character, you know, from, from Thor. Marvel, from Thor. Uh, Walt Simonson, you know, uh, worked with Loki a few times. Can you know compel women or sorry, men? <laughs> God, sorry, well, yeah, <laughs> maybe <laughs> compel uh, you know gods and mortals to do her will, as we see in the end of this episode. My beef with this is that I'm excited to see Jamie Alexander next week. That's going to be the talk of this episode. It's like Jamie Alexander's coming next week. Yeah, as Sif. She's hot. She, you've met her in person. She's a yeah. nice person. She's a great actress, like I like, but my beef with this is like they're using somebody else's, and it's Marvel, so it's all theirs, but it's like you're using something else to elevate your show. Like that's not Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Jamie Alexander's not gonna be on the show week to week. She's a no. special guest, which next week could be a cool episode, but it's not gonna save the entire season, which worries me. It's like, just because Sif's coming doesn't mean, oh, the show's good now. It's like, she's on it for one week. Yeah. And I'm excited to see her, because I love Jamie Alexander, but I, don't I know. wish they brought her in for more of an arc, like yeah, uh, Bill, like Bill Paxton. Paxton. Yeah, right. And then you yeah. can have like a whole like, okay, here's Sif and here's right. Because if it's what we think it is, then it's just going to be a one-off. Yeah, she'll come, she'll fight the girl, then they'll go away. They'll go back to Asgard. Yeah. Yeah. Then it's yeah. like, okay, that was a fun episode, but where do we go from here? Where at least these last two episodes were part of the Agents of Shield, right? Like, History, I guess, and yeah. part of the actual show with the the main character. Right, there's nothing wrong with. I mean, it is Marvel. There's nothing wrong with bringing in characters no. from the outside, but I feel like they're using it to almost like elevate well, like the a show. crutch. Like it's a crutch, yeah. And I know it's like be your own show mm -hmm. first, and then you can be even more awesome by bringing in other characters. But be a good show on your own first. Well, I don't think this show is done yet. No, that's my problem with. They the, need yesterday. much more consistency and yeah. in, in broadening out mm -hmm. all the characters. Uh, yeah, I, I, we we still. They're still trying to like tease us more with this <laughs> with this Agent Coulson death rebirth thing because they keep going with it. Yeah, because before they showed how he came back. Right. But now there's like there seems to be more to this because you got this alien Doctor Manhattan looking dude in the tube. Right. That that's that they're using to funnel this whatever that G four. Yeah. Uh, antidote or right. formula that they help save Sky with. Right. And 
you know, a lot of people are speculating that, oh, maybe that, that alien in there is like a Kree. Oh, or, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or maybe it's something else. Yeah. But. <laughs> it's, it's just, yeah, the mystery just hasn't grabbed me yet. The thing mm -hmm. is with. Even with Sky, because Sky's whole thing is just like, oh, uh, he was worried. Colson was worried mm -hmm. that Sky would experience the same pain he did. You know, like, I want to die. Let me yeah, die. Yeah. Kill me. It didn't happen. You know, it was all this mystery with her birth and who her parents mm -hmm. were and what ability she has and what she is. This whole destiny thing. And I, I want Sky needs to be a little more interesting for me to care. And I still don't care about her destiny or what. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, the whole thing. Like I said. At the end, I am excited to see Jamie Alexander next week. I'm excited to see this, you know, fight between these two beautiful girls. So that, that that's gonna that's gonna be fun. But uh, beyond that, again, yeah, I just don't know if I'm into the story as much as I wish I was. So I like Bill Paxton. I love Bill Paxton. Come on. Yeah, yeah, Gar as Garrett and yeah. he had his uh, second in command guy yeah. who, who fought with Ward for a yeah, little bit. Yeah. I did like. I like that. the banter between them. Them talk. I like that. I, like I also that. like that Ward had a history with Bill Paxton's character yeah. Garrett, mm -hmm. and he had worked with him before. Right. So mm -hmm. I thought that part was cool. Yeah. So I don't know. Hopefully they develop that more in the future episodes. Right. To give the show credit, it's not getting worse. No. It it has. It's getting marginally it's getting better. Marginally better. Just it's just very slow, but it, it is getting better. It is yeah. getting better. Not, I, I have to give it credit where credits due. Yeah. So hopefully they can <laughs> build off of it and. Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah, we'll see. <laughs> that's the that's the question. Right. So I don't know. What, what did you guys think? So you guys love this episode? Are you looking forward to next week's episode with uh, Jamie Alexander as yeah. Sif and that whole storyline? What do you think of the main characters for Agents of right, Shield? Yeah. Do you think they can carry the show? Right. On it on its own. Can it survive if it gets renewed? Or what, what's season two going to look like? Yeah. That's a long ways out. That's All right, guys. So you can post your comments <laughs> below on the website, thinkhero.com, or on our YouTube channel, Think Hero Pro. Make sure to subscribe to that. You also find us on Twitter. Talk to Dennis or Michael and myself about Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. You know, versus other superhero shows, Arrow. Uh, how, how do you compare the two? Do you like both? Uh, you can find us at Think Hero. I'm at Griffin DE. And we also have a Facebook page. That's facebook.com slash thinkherofans.